are celebrating a medical milestone today, the world's first kidney transplant between people living with HIV. This is quite a story. Jennifer Bellamy has been following it for us today, and it could be life-changing for so many thousands of people around the world. Yeah, that's right. Surgeons in Baltimore performed the procedure at John Hopkins University, and the doctor, uh, the patient rather, the donor, is a woman from Atlanta. Nina Martinez, who is a woman with HIV, donated a kidney to a stranger who is also HIV positive. She said she wanted to make a difference in somebody else's life. And Martina said she originally planned to donate to a friend with HIV, but that person passed away before that could happen. As for this case, doctors say both patients are recovering well. And 11 Alive medical correspondent Dr. Sujatha Reddy said this surgery reflects advancements in treatment for people living with HIV. What it tells us is people living with HIV are just as healthy as anybody else who can donate a kidney. And that tells us how far we've come through medication, detection early, treating these patients. They are now living long enough and healthy enough to donate a kidney. And what that means is this is now an untapped pool of donors who can now donate to all the HIV positive patients on the transplant list. And patients with HIV can receive transplants from HIV negative donors just like anyone else. But if more otherwise healthy donors with HIV are allowed to give, it could free up space on transplant lists. Doctors say there may be tens of thousands of people living with HIV who could now become living kidney donors.